Remember? Mom said you shouldn't buy any more junk. What, me? This is an antique store, not a junk store. Hey, check out the broken lamp. Boom! Ah! <laughs> Aren't they great? Ooh, they're creepy. It. You break your buy. It didn't break. Nice store. Yeah, if you like antiques. I kind of have my eye on this fountain here. It's uh, 20s nouveau art, isn't it? <laughs> More like 80s nouveau riche. <laughs> hey, I got you something at the antique shop today. Really? Surprise! Isn't it great? I saw you looking at it. Thought you'd like it for your room. Uh, sure, Dad. Thanks. Well, have fun. Good night, sweetie. Good night, Dad. What? I feel the same way, Fang. you. Class, Jack Pfeffer will be joining us for the rest of the term. Ah. Ah. Oh, what's the matter, Jack? <laughs> Scared of the little kitty cat? <laughs> Sorry. All right, Jack. Have you met somewhere before? Don't think so. Ahem, <clears throat> children. Sure, I know that kid. Come on. Uh, hi, Jack. How's it going? Hi. So, Jack, where are you from? Me and my dad move around a lot because of his antique business. He just opened a new shop here in town. Meow. Uh, afraid of cats, huh, new kid? <laughs> <laughs> Very funny, George. I'd leave now if I were you. Ooh, I'm scared. You should be. Sit, Mona. I'm gonna get you. Hey. Food fight. Food fight. Yahoo! Who wants dessert? Hey, what's going on here? I did not. Mona, you're coming to the office. And then after school, a detention. <laughs> you too, George. Let's go. Mona. I'm still gonna get you. It's your fault I got this detention. The punishment was spending quality time with George. And all because of that kid. Yeah. Thought I saw you guys. Thanks for helping me at lunchtime. Yeah, um, about that. Gotta go. Have to help my dad at the shop. But I hate being cooped up there. It's so cluttered. See ya. I have a distinct feeling that Jack is the Jack in the Box. Why? What do you mean? I saw him turn into one in the cafeteria. And just now, he said he hates being cooped up. And notice how he always pops up on us? But you said the Jack in the Box is hidden away in your closet. Hmm. Well, let's get some money and meet at Mr. Hyde's. Bang, are you coming? <gasps> oh. <gasps> he is gone. The 
back in the box has escaped from my closet. Really? What? It's him. We've got to find him and get him back in. Mr. Hyde! Hi, guys. Ah! What are you doing here? I thought you were helping your dad. I had to get out of that old antique shop. It's so crowded. I was getting claustrophobic. So I got a part-time job to get away from the shop. What can I get you? Um... Hmm, three chocolate milkshakes. Coming right up. <laughs> I love saying that. Jack, we want to help you with your problem. Uh, what problem? I don't have a problem. My dad might have a problem because he's all alone in the shop with no help. <laughs> but me? Nah, no problem. Whoops. Slippery little things, aren't they? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Let me help. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Try to get me back in the box now, Mona. Oh, no. What's happened here? Sorry. He's a little clumsy, but he'll get used to the pressures of ice cream vending. Mr. Hyde, I'm just not cut out for this ice cream thing. Hmm. Wow, Jack can't be such a bad guy if he gave us free movie tickets. Yeah, so what if he is a little clumsy? We can live with that. Especially if it means seeing the invasion of the malicious monkeys from Mars. He said it was his way of apologizing for messing us up at the ice cream shop. Let's hurry. Oh. Ah, yeah. uh... Jack, we need you in the projection booth to rewind the film reels. I'm on it, Mr. Henderson. Duty calls. <laughs> oh, no. After the mess at Mr. Hyde's and in the cafeteria, I don't think I'd hire Jack to work in my movie theater. Uh, what can go wrong? It's only a movie. and disappears like that. Okay, we need to get Jack back in the box. It can't be! The box! It's gone! Not here! Uh, by the way, Mona, I took the Jack in the box to be repaired. Fang must have ripped the Jack right out of it. If we want to get Jack back in it, we have to get that box before he does. Let's go. Stop right there, Jack. Enough is enough. Time to get back in the box. Now, really, Mona, why would I do a thing like that? I was just about to destroy it. <laughs> Until you get back in. Never! I'm sick of being cooped up. Get this furball off me! Here, catch! No! Hide and seek is for sissies. Come out, come out, wherever you are! No! Tell your dad I'll drop off this box soon as I finish repairing it. What a mess. I tell you, I think Jack is sick and tired of the antique business. And so am I. 
I think we need a long vacation. Yeah, good idea. Jack's maybe been cooped up a little too long. I just wanted to drop this off before we leave. Leave? Where? Me and my dad are ditching the antique biz. We're going to see the world. I'll send you a postcard or something. So long. Wait a sec. If Jack's in the car, then what or who is in the box? Uh, sorry, dear. Was I whistling again? Hey, kids! Y'all excited about going to the country? Shuck, sure am, Pa. But we better get there soon, because Charlie Boy's plumb near finished reading his latest copy of Unexplained Enigma's Digest. When I was a boy, this was a run-down old farm. But now some couple have bought it and spruced it up. If when you're looking for cob farms, you're here in Didi. Care for a chop? No, thanks. I'm trying to cut down on... on raw corn. Hi, hi, hi! Welcome to Cobbs. Oh, we've got just oodles of old-time farm activities for young and old alike. I bet you kitties can't wait to get to the pony rides and petting zoo. Oh, well. well, you simply must join our quilting bee. Pow! And you can join us in the milking barn. Come on, dear. You always told me you loved folk arts. So, we have a choice between busting this wild bronco or petting some pigs. Field report here. Volume steady. Good turnover. Go ahead with the share offer. Crop circle landing platform designs. Two percent complete. Fifty percent of the float in stock options. And uh, th th that, that is the stock, uh, uh, the livestock. <laughs> yes, they're all fat and healthy. <laughs> Bye. All done here already? Well, we got to pick your own strawberry patch just up the hill. It's fun, fun, fun. Did we see you? what I think we saw? Yeah, strange, but she seems harmless enough. This patch has almost been picked clean by all the other pickers. What other pickers? There are lots of cars in the lot, but we seem to be the only ones here. Found one! <laughs> Circle. There was an article on them in Unexplained Enigmas. Sea monsters, lost continent of Atlantis. Here it is, crop circles. Matrix plasma structures, believed to be created by aliens. Tell your geomatic shells that Whoa, are... Whoa, back up. Created by aliens? That's one theory. Like they want to send humans messages or something. Well, I hear them loud and clear. An alien. Some kind of extraterrestrial tractor that did a little harvesting here and left a couple of farmers behind to tend the crops. Mr. and Mrs. Cobb, we gotta investigate. There's no choice. Aliens? Um, another choice might be to go home. People been going in all day, but nobody's come out. We better warn my mom and dad. Look! I crunched the numbers. We got the figures to go franchise. Next e-cargo shuttle is imminent. 
can't warn Dad with Mr. Cobb so close. Better check on Mom. <laughs> Circle landing platform designs completed. Mr. and Mrs. Cornhead are keeping pretty close tabs on Mom and Dad. They seem safe for now, but... Whoops-a-daisy! <laughs> Almost spilled your pick-me-up after all that picking! <laughs> Ice-cold lemonade. We serve it to all our guests. Um, are my parents still here? Oh, uh, they've gone. <laughs> gone to the corn. Dump it! Uh huh? It's mind control serum. Oh! There are often dangerous energy vortexes within a crop circle. Boss wants us to finish all the pruning before lunch. Alien crew members. And they're armed. But no more work for us once we fill the Earthling slave shovel. That's their evil plan. E-cargo must mean Earthling cargo. Intruders spotted at Sector 7 perimeter. Block the cornstalks. I repeat, block the cornstalks. Perimeter damage to crop circle. Perimeter pots are never, never to be stepped on. Perimeter damage was inflicted by three Earthling juveniles wearing atypical apparel and a mammalian quadruped. Three kids and a cat? I know who those kids are. <laughs> hey, get back here, you. Uh, uh, why, what you little scamps up to? We gotta find the crop circle center. All energy radiates from there and... I hope he didn't see us. So Zatman, any ideas on how to find the circle center? Perfect camouflage. You never guess it was a spaceship under all that. But there sure doesn't seem to be much energy radiating around here. I must have tried ten times to get out, but I just kept ending up here. I tell you, it's impossible. Oh, they just want you to buy more stuff at the snack bar. Speaking of which, think I'll get another corn burger. Welcome to Cobb Farm Foods. What can I get you? Corn dog, corn on the cob, popcorn. Or you can check out our quality souvenirs in the gift shop. The wonderful world of corn. Watch corn grow in the comfort of your own home. Cool. Today's e-cargo loading to commence in three minutes. Crop circle circuitry aligned. Hmm. According to my magazine, the crop circle's what gives them their takeoff energy. Test is affirmative. Perimeters are solid. No breaches in circuit. We have to breach their circuit. What does that mean? I don't know, but we better do it. Full cop alert! Three rebel juvenile earthlings have penetrated circle. Prepare for emergency in case of breach in the energy field. Rebels may be dangerous. They have not, I repeat, not ingested mind control serum. Prepare for liftoff. How do we breach the energy field? Uh-oh! Let's go! Stop, rebels! Come on! This way! I think this might be the energy field we have to breach, but how? They're loading the ship! Yes, and you're coming too. Uh-oh. Breach in force field! Breach in force field! That's it! 
The energy field. It's kept in by the corn walls. Let's stop corn. <laughs> Breach in energy field. Abort e-cargo shipment. We did it! We blew the crop circle circuit! We yes, did it! Did it. Oh, yeah. I thought we were gonna be lost in there forever. <laughs> now we'll have to delay the whole franchise deal and... Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> Shucks, if when you couldn't figure out the corn maze, all you had to do was ask. We'd have shown you the way out. You're not really a farmer, are you? Ah, uh, you got me there, kid. I'm no farmer. I'm a businessman. We offer wholesome fun for the whole family here at Cobb Farms Crazy Corn Maze. About to go countrywide soon. Fantastic ground floor investment opportunity. Here, take my card. Um, yeah. Now, if you'll excuse us, we have some infrastructure repair to do. They better hurry. Their ship's leaving soon. Looks like we're gonna get a hailstorm. Hailstorm? I don't think so. It's them. They're blasting off. 